Okay, today I wanted to take a look at a comment I got on a video I made a couple of months ago on uh, Valerie Allman. Uh, the question pretty much starts with, uh, they'd like to know if she's actively dropping her left knee into the circle. And uh, I think uh, if you take a look at that, we'll be able to see that she, there's no, no question that she's uh, dropping it intentionally into the circle. Right here, by, by rotating that knee, the left knee, into the circle and dropping it down, that's going to give her the drive to go forward across the circle. Another point here is uh, dropping that knee down allows this left thigh to become uh, vertical so that you can rotate around it. Let's take a look at another video here. Okay, you can see her rotating here. Interesting right here, you can see she's on the uh, the big toe because her foot is angled. Brings it around and drops it straight down and in. Stops the le left foot right here toward the throwing direction. Keeps that left knee bent or down low and bent and then comes off with it bent right there so she's driving across and not going upward let's take a look at another video this is a good uh, this is a good view right here as you can see right here she extends that left leg and then she'll drop back down the knee will rotate I like to think of rotating the knee rather than the foot and drops it right down stops the knee, stops the foot, the rotation, and then drives forward. And here again you can see the uh, vertical left thigh so she can rotate around it quickly. Here's a view from the front. I made a comment on this uh, on another video I did earlier you can see the, uh, a lot of people are rotating this right foot, or this, I'm sorry, this right knee directly to 9 o'clock. You see Valerie Allman's actually bringing it toward the camera toward 12 o'clock. She'll get up on that uh, right toe right here. You can see instead of rotating it in, she's um, getting a farther distance between her knees. That's a, another point of dropping that knee and rotating that knee outward so she can create this stretch. And then there's going to be a stretch reflex where it's going to allow that uh, right leg to snap forward and into the throw. If you take a look right here, right to the center of the forefoot there, right through her uh, armpit there. Let's take a look at uh, Alecna, right through the center of the forefoot. Almost the same, except you can see that uh, the line, this this vertical axis here, this left side axis, goes right through his knee. Or in Valley Roman, it does not. She has uh, much more bend in that knee. You can see how close her hip is to the uh, vertical line here, this vertical axis she's created, and where Alecna keeps his uh, hip back. But they both go right through the armpit, so they both create this uh, this axis here. Okay, let's take a look at. Uh, Another video on Valerie Allman. Let's finish this one here. Okay, there's the stretch. Wide, very wide space between the knees. She's going to bring that right foot around, and it's just going to... She's got the uh, knee behind the hip. She's got this foot really high above the horizontal, and then she's going to snap that right into the uh, sweep and down right there and fully extended. So I think this, uh, of course, is just everything I'm assuming. I'm not her, you know, I don't, I haven't talked to her coach. I don't know anything <laughs> what the coach has told her, what they've been working on, obviously. But uh, this is just what I'm seeing and what I'm uh, gathering. Yeah, the stretch that she's creating here, it's, it's just, I think it really helps to bring that right foot around and snaps it through for that quick uh, right leg sweep. Let's take a look at the next video.
You see how here she's fully in her preparation. She's fully extended the left leg. She's going to drop down right here. Okay. Now I'll, I'll go back to the video on the left side, same position right here. Okay. Now let's watch as uh, Valerie Roman continues to go around in her windup. She's going to fully extend that left leg. See that right there. Now she's going to start to drop down and she's going to get back into that position she had earlier. The only difference is earlier on the, on the right that uh, left heel was down and now on the uh, left photo she's actually starting her turn the uh, left heel is up and she shifted her, her hips just a little bit and you can see again the foot becomes vertical here she's not turning the, uh, the heel out on the right and bringing the knee in she's keeping those knees separated I think so she can get a stretch reflex stretch and then a reflex action right there just snaps that foot down okay well I think uh, I think that makes it pretty clear that she's intentionally turning that uh, that knee it's not just a, an action of her shifting or whatever it's a uh, it's for a purpose it's getting it that knee right here down to the uh, the throwing sector and keeping the, her low so she can drive across then also creating the stretch between the knees I think okay if anybody has a different uh, theory or opinion you can uh, put it down in the comments but uh, thanks very much